So why do we need another blockchain? My personal journey was an employee of Kick Interactive uh, trying to build Kin. Kin was the first uh, billion dollar company going into blockchain. My previous company was uh, Visualid. It was uh, an AR, VR company. It was acquired by Alibaba and it, it became the R&D center of uh, Alibaba in Israel. When I was thinking, you know, what should be, you know, my next adventure, my brother, Danny, he told me, go learn about blockchain and I started going into blockchain. Orbs is, is quite different than the rest of the industry and from other blockchain infrastructures. Ops is practical. We've seen the needs of our customers, we've seen the needs of people trying to move to blockchain, and we think we found practical solutions to most of the challenges that arise as you try to make the transition. Many of these consumer applications struggle because the economy around consumer applications is very centralized, and smaller companies, they can't thrive, they can't succeed in this space. You need to build big projects. You need to go with everything you have, with all the armory that you have. Blockchain is a very uh, fertile ground nowadays for creating new teams when creating a culture for an engineering team. The main challenge is creating the right seed for the engineering group. Everything is an evolutionary system so that your, your job when creating a new thing is not to build it, but rather to shape it. There's no one blockchain to rule them all. We see uh, the languages and the environments for development as a major barrier. By being polyglot, we're enabling a lot of the users to reduce these barriers and choose a language that they already have knowledge of using. The blockchain industry is an enabler for a paradigm shift, probably one of the biggest that we had in centuries. We are developing a new type of blockchain infrastructure. It's meant to be used by real large-scale consumer apps and who offer real products in the real world. It's kind of at the edge of technology. What the technology was trying to do was really to disrupt the most fundamental things in our world. I think blockchain technologies can introduce new revolutionary economic models, new ways of monetizing, new business models, and I think this is going to change this world completely.